Hi folks, Derek Clark from the Rangers Review here. Now one of the big talking points following Saturday's 4-0 win over Hibs at Ibrox was unfortunately the sickening graffiti that was left by the travelling supporters in the away section. Now Ali McCoist has blasted those responsible on TalkSport this morning. Both clubs condemned the graffiti and stickers left in the away section, which mocked the Ibrox disaster back in 1971. Under a thousand Hibs supporters were in attendance for the defeat. And when they left at the Mers, that some seats had been defaced with the number 66. There were also photographs of Stairway 13 where the disaster occurred, stuck on the seats with the images accompanied by the words Stairway 13. It's the greatest sight that I have ever seen. Graffiti also mocked the death of Queen Elizabeth II and supported the IRA. Speaking on talk sport, McCoy slammed the sickening stunt as he questioned the mental state of those involved. He said, putting stickers and writing 66 on the seats of the Ibrox, I actually don't think football is a problem there. I don't. That's a mental problem with someone. These guys are using football as a vehicle for their aggression and their stupidity. That problem is deeper than football. That is a societal problem. That is people who are not right in the head, to be brutally honest with you. Who in their right mind goes to organise stickers and celebrate the death of people? It's absolutely ridiculous. Well, Hibs have since moved swiftly and one fan has been banned from attending matches. A statement at the weekend read, Hibernian FC is aware of the intolerable graffiti and stickers found in the away end at Ibrox today and condemns the behaviour of the individuals that were involved. The club will work with Rangers to identify those responsible and will take the most serious action possible against anyone involved. If any Hibernian FC supporter has any information that could assist the club to help identify these individuals, they should contact club at hibernianfc.co.uk and the information provided will be dealt with in the strictest of confidence. So there you go, folks. Alan McCoy is having his say on that sickening graffiti discovered at Ibrox over the weekend. If you want to keep up to date with all the latest news coming out of Ibrox, be sure to subscribe to the Rangers Review YouTube channel. Bye for now.